Hey guys, it's Gabby here with another video for you today. I love y'all and it's like, I don't know, I think it's like 11, 30, 12 o'clock at night, at like the end of my day after like doing some errands and cleaning up my room or whatever, but um, I was going to do some stuff to my bike. <sighs> like, what was it, yesterday or the day before, I went to Mountain Creek and got to go ride some downhill bikes to get a little taste and now I'm just over here excited. When am I gonna go ride my bike again? And when I was riding, I was like, dude, I'm really sick of my brake pads being contaminated and being all squeaky and not really working. So, one, I have a new set of brake pads, but some of y'all on the Instagram told me a few other ways that I could fix it without having to get new brake pads. So we're gonna try that out today. I figured it'd be fun to make this video and now you'll know that if this works for me, it'll work for you, okay? So this is just the last minute. YOLO, let's just try and see what I can do with my brake pads, okay? <laughs> let's go ahead and, and then get cracking. There she is, the beautiful downhill bike, right? Right, yes, yes. So here, let me show you all what it does right now. All right, so I'm just, I'm on my brakes a little bit. <laughs> now, now I just wanna do it, what the frick? Ugh, ah. You know what? Fine, fine, fine. I will overcome this. Don't you worry. <sighs> See? They're all squeaky squeaking. So I'm like riding down the trail with my bike and I'm like, Ree! like down the whole side of the mountain. Plus, when they're contaminated, they don't really work that well. So I'm gonna go ahead and fix that, or at least just mess around with it. <laughs> hey, baby doll. All right, cool. So what y'all basically told me to do on Instagram was to take out the brake pads, right? Clean off the rotor with a little bit of rubbing alcohol, and then. Some of you told me to use sandpaper to slightly like sand down some of the uh, like the few layers of the brake pad, but I don't have sandpaper, so I got this really fine file. <laughs> I'll just go ahead and try out. Like I said, I have extra brake pads, so if it doesn't work, then this is fine. Also, there's two types of sink brake pads. There's the organic and then the metal. Um, I, some of you guys told me that this technique doesn't work with the organic pads because they just kind of absorb whatever type of contaminant is already on them. Um, but for the metal ones, this technique might work. Might work. Is that right? Litonare. Bark with me if you're my dog. Bark. Or not. <laughs> okay, let's try taking this wheel off. Very nice. Right now, even though I just put it back together. So I guess I'll clean this first, just because it's like the easiest thing to do. And knowing me, I will probably forget. <laughs> but, whoa. Okay, there we are, rubbing alcohol. Oh, just eat everywhere. ever so slightly going to rub the disc brake gently with rubbing alcohol, evenly coated to get all of the debris and contaminant. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me. <laughs> all, right, cool. all right, that's clean, that's easy. Easy enough. I need a little itty bitty Allen key. Little itty, little itty bitty Allen key. Smaller than that one. I hope that they have the right size. Yes, now Okay, more kiosiels for you. Smaller than that one. Okay, smaller than that one. What about this one? Gosh darn it, the one that I need is missing. Aha! Great success! We have found the Allen key. All right, cool. All right, now I'm gonna do this. By the way, the brakes that I have are the new Shimano Saint uh, brakes, like the M280 or whatever. They're the newest ones. 
They're actually really great because I have really small hands. So lady shredders out there, if you got small hands, get the Saints because they have the most adjustability. Um, and it's really kind of the only thing that I can use comfortably. And pull. There we are. Got them out. like the little metallic clip that goes in between them. Because you just, you never know. You just never know what's going to be on all of this stuff. All of it. Worse, or making it better. All right. All right, now to the filing. Cha-ching. <laughs> no idea this is going to work. YOLO. This is kind of like what they look like after being filed down. No different than what they looked like before. So I'm gonna go ahead and install them and see if this makes a difference. Good news is that I found the missing Allen key. <laughs> it's funny how life works like that. Not gonna lie, it's really humid, really sticky. Look, I'm at 12 o'clock at night and I'm sweating. It's hot, okay? And look at my hair, it's all like humid. Okay, um, let's see if these brakes work. freaking go <laughs> also I just want to say thank you guys because I got this idea from you guys on Instagram you guys are the best best supporters out there you're always a part of whatever I'm doing and I genuinely take your advice into consideration all the freaking time so I'm just saying thank you because this is from you guys and I love you and I'm sharing with you that it freaking works and I'm happy <laughs> okay thank you guys love you guys so much Mwah!